Um, see a baby withdraw. Never, ever, ever forget it. The fentanyl crisis just keeps going. And I, I don't know, it's kind of one of those, it's like, are we, are we ever gonna get a little bit better? And the mother may or may not know that she's been taking this that has been laced with fentanyl. So we do the testing on the babies. So we send either the meconium or the baby's first poops for testing, but we also send the umbilical cord tissue um, for testing and that will specifically look for fentanyl. which is a fancy uh, bassinet that when baby cries, which is a swing that will do it. It's catalog of all swings. Everyone that is uh, here at Hushabai, everyone. in every room we do have Narcan. Everyone that is here at Hushabai, everyone um, gets educated on how to give Narcan. You never know when you're going to have someone that struggles that you're going to need this. Fentanyl crisis has really changed the game of drug addiction. It's not just in opiates. It's in meth. You know, it's in crystal. It's in cocaine. So we do see fentanyl a lot. Uh, the moms are either using it or misusing the fentanyl. So if you look at the numbers in the early 2000s, um, so the NAS babies only accounted for about 1.2 per thousand births in the hospitals. Uh, but now we have increased to about 8.8 .8 on an average per thousand hospital births. 